Scotland's always had a four-year degree and it's a distinctive part of university education up here. The Scottish degrees enable the students in, in their first year especially to experiment. What it does is it avoids that early specialisation that we see in other educational systems and that seemed to be a, a real weakness. And it's partly about the chance for students to try things and then realise they don't like it because there's no other way really of, of finding out, especially those subjects that they're not offered at school. Which enables you to compare the differences between anthropology and Islamic studies and architecture. Mandarin, Spanish, Hindi. Economic history, history, politics. But it needs uh, a university as large as this, a school as large as this, for students to be able to, to really make the most of this. Because you have more time to study other subjects alongside your main degree subject, I think it helps you to put that degree subject in an interdisciplinary context. You need time to let it sink in, and it's not just the rhythm of the academic calendar, but it's also the sort of the duration of those years by which you slowly become apprenticed as a sociologist or a political scientist, an anthropologist. So you've got the first year, and to some extent part of the second year, to settle in, to find your feet, to learn the academic skills that are different from being at school. You've then got two years in which you get involved in things, you get much more um, deeply ingrained in the subject. Where we begin to go into levels of study, depth of study, that is more at master's level actually. I think on the three-year system um, there's a tendency to be finished before you've really started getting into the material but the two honours years I think really give a, a possibility to go a bit further with a subject that you that you really like. That's just a great opportunity that we give our students is to write the dissertation in the fourth year because that's a chance to really have your own independent work. It can provide an opportunity for students to, for example, undertake a policy report for a particular organisation. You know, a deeper understanding of the issues that they can really explore in a university environment here. There's also a really practical um, advantage to it, and that's in terms of employability and comparative advantage. But certainly in, in Scotland, you're, you're closer to that kind of um, attempt to create a, a well-rounded um, graduate at the end of the day. And I think a four-year degree really prepares you for the job market as well because you would have got quite, quite a good foundation.